What's good everyone? Hope everyone's doing well, staying safe. This is Erden and we are back with another Live Cop video. Just want to say, first of all, apologies for the lack of videos last week on Live Cops. Your boy was not feeling too well. Was a little bit under the weather and um, feeling better now this week. Don't worry, I don't have the coronavirus, so uh, you guys don't have to worry about getting infected. Oh, I should be good to go. So with that being said, I wasn't really able to record a ton of footage and I wasn't able to have time to really edit the videos. But uh, last week there were a few quite high drops. Your boy struck out on both of them with the Grateful Dunk and then also the Off-White Force. But it is what it is. I was able to catch one of the J-Round uh, New Balance releases on Restock on Cyber last week. That was pretty cool. I got a few of the Jordan 12s uh, that I was able to cop and then also got a few of the Funko Pops during the San Diego Comic-Con release. Uh, a few of them got canceled because I really didn't jig my profiles too hard, but I still got one black lining on the way. So pretty excited about that. But other than that, this week we don't have a ton of releases. We have the Zion Jordan 34 coloring book. So that one definitely could see a few bucks being made from resale. Um, we also have the Jason Tatum Jordan 34s dropping. I don't know how much of a resale that has. We do have the Reebok and Eric Emanuel uh, mid called a question. So that one seems like has a decent amount of resale profit. Not a whole lot of release. We're expecting an easy day on August the 2nd, but that is up in the air at this of now. Um, last year, it was a huge deal, right? Like everyone was getting in their emails, a countdown timer uh, from Easy Supply. So everyone was like, what the hell is that? And then turned out that to be an easy day. Uh, where there's a ton of retro Yeezys that were being released throughout the day. So we'll see what happened this year and if it's happening on the same day, August 2nd. So, just want to say thank you guys for the continuous support. Uh, we're almost at our new goal of 500 subscribers. So if you haven't done so yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell for us, alright? And also, if you do like this video, smash the like button for us with the thumbs up. And let's get into this week's Live Cops. one got one nice falco came in let's do it oh nice nice oh got another one i got the stussy slides too nice couldn't get the zion stuff the zions is out i think the zion's out of stock yeah i couldn't get the zions mm. but i got one here that's not bad couldn't get anything here though There you go, got one, nice. Got one, dude. I'm finally started getting the hang of Shopify a little bit more. Shout out to this new cook group I just joined called Essentials by Dr. Saeed. Uh, this cook group is mainly teaching people about how to use spots. You know, most cook groups is you know, dealing with the resales when it comes to like pulls, switches, uh, Funko Pops, everything else. But this one is mainly focusing on teaching you how to use different bots. And uh, they were able to give me some really useful information. And finally, I started getting the hang of Shopify a little bit more. And uh, as you can see, I was able to get one checkout on these uh, Eric Emanuel Reebok question mids. So I'm pretty happy about that. Um, definitely been helpful. Uh, and definitely learned a little bit more about Shopify releases got one hey guys all right so as you can see we got a ton of shipments coming in for the past two weeks unfortunately i wasn't able to do unboxing for you guys last week but we still got a ton of shoes left after some uh moving around and flipping so so as you can see we got a ton of these easy 350 zions i didn't really have an exact stand, standing count at this moment i if i recall correctly i believe i got a total of 20 uh, confirmed shipment. So uh, I already moved a few of them. So we still have pieces of what we have left. So I really like this. I think this is a really good colorway. Uh, so the price is not holding up as much as I hope it would, but I'm not surprised either. I expect it to go up later on as time goes on. This is a really good looking shoe, to be honest. This is by far my favorite 350, other than the the triple black one. So I think this one will go up in value. Definitely a good pair of shoes. This. So this is the surprise flip of the week or past two weeks or so. 
These Jordan 12s, uh, I'm not a big fan of these, but surprisingly, these are moving really fast. All four of them we expect to go out tomorrow anyway, so. But yeah, I mean, like I said, I'm not a big fan of it, but I can see why people like these. So we got a ton of shoes releasing during August, so I don't wanna go too hard on these to waste my capitals and also don't wanna risk my profiles get flagged. So yeah, so I only went for a few of these. Um, not too bad at all, really good flip. So, so these are the Air Force One Jew Leaks. Uh, I was really using my TSB to test my accounts and surprisingly I was able to hit four of these and one of these New York versus New York re um, during their sneaker restocks. Um, I like these Air Force Ones. I never had a pair of Air Force Ones until recently and I really like these. So um, yeah, I think the Jew Leaks actually sound better than the, the New York versus New York, but this one is my size, I might keep it for myself. So that's it for the unboxing. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, remember, you guys need to stay tuned for the month of August because we've got a ton and ton of hype releases coming up and your boy got some secret weapons in stock for you guys, all right? So in the meantime, keep it cool, keep it real, deserted. Peace out.